probably know this guy because you are probably his most famous baseball player. At least the very first superstar, but we'll talk about that in a future episode. Let's just get started. We are going to talk about today about Babe Roof, the very first superstar. Narcosian, Narcosian, they are Babe Ruth. Today, what we're talking about baseball. Ba 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 ba. All right, hey guys, and welcome to a new episode on this channel. And today, we'll be talking about. Babe Ruth, and I'll get my helmet ready and steady, and so let's just get started. Now we all know who Babe Ruth is, well, we'll probably know, because he is one of the greatest superstars of baseball history. I guess he's already in the Hall of Fame, and he is, has a very a lot of facts. Right, Ghost Guy? Yes, I am Ghost Freak, yeah! Uh, well, other than that, it is, he is pretty good. Babe, well, this guy is as good as he could be, and now this is where he went to school. This is his school, and he just, well, hated going there. He hated school. The police were his enemy because they made him go to school, tried to make him go to school. Eventually, his parents gave up trying to make him go to school, and then they actually just sent him to school. Sent him to boarding school without telling him that he was going to boarding school because they knew that he would fight. He came, they came to a place and then they said, they talked to the principal and then they left him there. And then when he asked the principal what was happening, he was like, you're at school. And like, no! And tried to escape and then the mortar man caught him. And I read recess, however. At the end of the day, at recess, the teacher, actually, a teacher took notice of him and saw his baseball potential and taught him a lot of baseball. And eventually was able to play baseball and won six hundred dollars per year by just playing pro baseball eventually getting um getting switched to the boston red sox but that's in the moment and yeah he did a lot of records he did a lot of bat ba home run records and at the end of his career he had 714 home runs in 22 seasons and he was in the baseball hall of fame of 1936 he only there were, he's he's in third place of the most home runs in the world, and the only people who are able to beat that record, who are able to beat his seven hundred fourteen home run record, was uh was Hank Aaron seven hundred fifty five home runs, and Barry Bonds seven hundred sixty two, seven hundred and sixty two, of the of these home runs. And that's what we're very interested in about Babe Ruth. I mean, I'm not very into baseball, so I didn't really research much about him. But that is all I can get about him. And also, he, oh, okay, no, now for some facts about Babe Ruth. Babe Ruth was born on February 6, 1895 as German Herman Ruth Jr. His father was Germ, George Herman Ruth. Uh, and on 1902, June 13th, he, is, he was sent to the St. Mary's Industrial School for industrial school for boys, which is this school right here. And on February 14, 1914, he goes to play for the Baltimore Orioles, which he starts his career as a baseball player. And then he goes to the Red Sox that he sold to the Brooklyn Dodgers, which we now know as the LA Dodgers. Bad move, Red Sox. This is. And in the same year, he marries a woman named Helen Woodford. And on May 6, 1915, he hits his first major league home run. Eventually hitting 714 home runs in his whole career. And years later, after his retirement, he has hit 714 home runs. When he died, he held 54 major league records, 714 home runs in 22 seasons, and every one out of four balls he hit was a home run. And that really was a D. That really is a D end, a very good D end. And at least he finished his career at a very strong end. And all I'm going to say is that that was as much as he could do. 
for his whole career. We all know how this world is like, and we just need to know what this is going to be like. But once we know what the world is, we can now guess what it would be like to live in it. So yeah, that is technically the end of this episode. And I didn't really use notes at all in this episode because notes are starting to get boring, so I'll delete that. And that really is the end. Hope you guys learned something new about Babe Ruth in this very short Dark Shun episode. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Shine out and peace.